What is going on everybody, this is your boy Dropper here, bringing you guys another Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle video. And in today's video, we're just going to sit back and talk about the next unit that I kind of want to be, well, not really the next unit I want, but, you know, the units that could potentially be next after Angel Golden Frieza. So, we're just going to hop into this, but if you guys enjoyed today's video, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button, and yeah. Wait, follow me on Twitter as well, there will be a link down in the description for that, but... Like I said, we hop right into this. But honestly, really, really, after Angel Golden Frieza, because for those who don't know, I didn't do a summon video on, on Angel Golden Frieza. I really just summoned off camera. And I was hoping that I would be able to pull Angel Golden Frieza, but I haven't. So that's why I, right now on Extreme D Awakening, I'm only at level 20. And at this point, I really don't care about getting Angel Golden Frieza, because I haven't got him this whole time, so it's like at this point I really I really don't care about getting him. But that's why part of me hope that Super Saiyan 3 Bardock is next. Because he could potentially be on that banner. Now, is he gonna be on that banner hundred percent? Like, I don't know. It's global. They could change it up, because global is known for doing that. They're known for changing their banners and switching it up all the time. So Bardock could potentially I mean yeah, the Bardock banner could potentially take Frieza out. I mean, yeah, Frieza off that banner. But, I don't know. That's why part of me wish... Like, I hope that Bardock is next. Because not only do I want to get Angel Golden Frieza and Bardock so I can kill two birds and one stone, but at the same time, I do like that Super Saiyan 3 category team. Now, I do need Super Saiyan 3 Broly because when he came to Global, I did a couple summons. But I didn't pull him, so I really didn't go too crazy for him. Because the time he came to Global, he really wasn't optimal. Like, he, his team sucked. So I was like, well, if I don't have any use for him now, I really don't want him. That's how I was thinking. But it's like, now that Bardock may be next after Angel Golden Frieza, now I'm just like, okay, now I should have went for Bro. I mean, yeah, I should have went for Broly. So that's just, that's just how I'm thinking about Broly. And, I mean, not Broly, but Bardock. And then, really, if it's not Bardock that's next, I hope that it's Tech, Vegito Blue, and, um, uh, what's it called? STR, Rose, Goku Black. Just because the hype around them was, like, amazing on JP. And plus, those two, are, those two units are amazing. And then we all remember how hyped, um, what's it called? Physical Vegito Blue and um, AGL Rose was when they first came to Global and JP. Those units were hype, and I remember summoning it on Vegito Blue first, and I ended up pulling Physical Vegito Blue, and then I summoned on Rose, but I didn't pull Rose till like later on down the line. And then so it's just like I got I got good units for that team. I got good units for that team, and I got good units for Super Saiyan three category team. So it's just like. And I don't know which out of those two. I don't know which ones I want to be next. Like really, I don't. I, I don't know, cause uh, Gogeta, uh, not Gogeta, but Vegito and Rose are gonna be a dual banner. And what's it called? Bardock is just Bardock. Super Saiyan Three Bardock was. He, it was just a single banner. It wasn't a dual banner or anything. So that's like, that's 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 where I'm kind of at for the next banner. Cause like I said, for both banners. Well, not for both banners, but for the Bardock banner, I could potentially kill two birds one stone. I can get Super Saiyan 3 Bardock, and I can get Angel Golden Frieza if he's on that banner. Cause like I said, it's global. Global is known for switching things up. So, I don't know. And then, for the Super Saiyan 3s, I mean for uh, Tech Vegito Blue and Rose, I got good units for those teams. So, that's why I'm just like iffy about that as well I'm like well I got good units for both teams and I could potentially just make good videos and just have fun with both those teams but oh I forgot to heal up darn it well hopefully I could take somebody out because I did not heal up now for, I, and for, I forgot about how that's what happens when I'm just talking and just in autopilot I forgot to heal up so hopefully one of them don't super attack because that's somebody do I am in trouble so let me know down in the comments 
who do you guys want to be next? It can be the two the two units I talked about, or it could be any other unit after that, or b b after those units. Because really, like I said, I either want Bardock or Vegito Blue and Rose. Because it's like those two are just those those three units are just all hype, especially the Super Saiyan three. Because Broly is just amazing on that team. His own individual team, not so much, but uh, the Super Saiyan 3 category team, Broly is just amazing. And it's just like, I think he like the hardest hitting unit on that team. So it's like, I'm just like in a tough situation. So it's like, ah, do I do I want, do I want Bardock to be next or do I want Go Vegito and Rose to be next? So it's just like, ah, I, I just don't know. I just don't know. And really, I really to be honest, I want Vegito Blue and Tech um not Tech Vegito Blue and STR Rose to um be next. So that's just the that's just where I'm at. I really want those two to be next. Just because like I said, Vegito Blue just Vegito in general is my favorite fusion. And then Rose is just a good unit as well. But hopefully I don't have as bad as luck on his banner like I did on his AGL banner because AGL banner I mean every every banner AGL Rose came on I just could not pull him until like back in December when he was on the Ultra Instinct Goku banner I finally pulled him and I'm just like about time but it's funny because they finna get ready to drop the STR Rose soon here on Global and I'm just now pulling the AGL even though the AGL Rose is still good to this day, as long as well as the physical Super Vegito, especially if you got them 100% in the potential system or you just got orbs invested in them, then they're still good units. Uh, okay, now we're on the tech phase, about time. I was gonna do the Angel Golden Freeze event, but I decided nah, I've already did that. I've done like two videos on that, and I know you guys are probably tired of seeing that event because you guys are probably grinding the event and got the medals and everything so I'm not gonna do that uh can I get three uh yeah there we go right there so I got that three uh guess I'll give those to him and then I'm trying to save those reds for Vegito Blue just because I already know Vegito Blue is gonna do some nasty damage when he get on the field all right so hopefully if he super attacks anybody is Super Saiyan 4 of Goku Cause you guys already know we got that potential chance to counter it. The boy, here we go with the ten times Kamehameha. Ah, boy, can I get a critical, please? Critical Goku. Yes, there we go. Got the critical from Goku. I love my Super Saiyan for Goku. I just need two more dupes to get him to a hundred percent. Need one more dupe for my Super Saiyan for Gogeta. And I hope that Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta comes back on one of, the, one of the two banners I was talking about. Either Bardock or Vegito Blue. But I can potentially see him more on the Vegito Blue banner than, than the Bardock banner, honestly. But, yeah. And when it, whichever banner is next out of the Vegito Blue and Rose or the Super Saiyan 3 Bardock, I hope that my luck is good because recently my luck has just been back and forth. It's just like... A banner comes, sorry I took that pause, it's like a banner comes, then my luck is here, I pull the unit I want, then it's like the next two banners, it's just my luck is gone. For example, Ink Gogeta, when he came to Global, I just could not pull him for nothing in the world, and then when Ultra Instinct Goku came, I couldn't pull him for nothing in the world, but then I finally pulled him on my last multi summon, and then Physical Gotenks came, couldn't pull him. Then physical Vegito, uh, physical Super Vegito came, couldn't pull him. So it's just like my luck with these banners lately has just been trash. And I'm just like, man, I hope the next banner, even Angel Golden Freezer has done me, just been trash. It's just the banner is just hates me. So hopefully, if Bardock is next, I can pull him, or if Vegito Blue, or I should say Tech Vegito Blue and STR Rose are next, hopefully I can pull Vegito Blue. Cause I don't want to go deep in these banners like I've been doing. Like, oh my gosh, it's been so crazy. I've been going so deep in these banners, and it's just like, why? I, I don't want to go deep in these banners. I just want to pull these units off my like on my second or third multi summon and call it the day. That's all I want. But it's like, don't come kind of like, uh, 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 uh. You got so many good units. You not your luck is about to be on and off, dropper. I'm sorry. So it's like, oh my gosh. 
But here we go. The final stage, and we just got rid of, well, Vegito Blue was just in the last rotation, so the bad thing about that is I, I gotta try to save all those STR orbs for him, or those red orbs. Uh, I'm definitely gonna put Goku in the front, just because if he can get a super attack off, he can take those. Do that, bring those down for Vegeta, and, hmm, well, I guess I could potentially save those for... Oh, my tablet from the grade die. That's the problem with me in this tablet. My tablet always going to die. But I did use a Princess Snake, so hopefully... Oh, yep, there we go. So I'm tanking those attacks. And if he super attacks anybody, please let it be Super Saiyan 4 Goku, just because, like I said, the potential chance to counter. And but like I, I always say this when I use Super Saiyan 4 Goku Vegeta, you really can't depend on their counters like you can Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, so... But, I can depend on my boy Super Saiyan 4 Goku and the crits, though. That's what I can depend on. So hopefully, Vegito Blue can get his Ultra Super Attack, and it can be a critical. And if it's not, then hopefully it could be an additional Super Attack with the critical. So, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what this game, because sometimes the potential system can play around and just not just not do his job but here we go str super gogeta with the soul punisher i still want to hurry up and pull the int one but for now the str one is still good uh okay there we go uh he no super attack so far but i feel like when the Gito blue gets on the field there's gonna be a super attack so, really I don't need to heal up, but I'm just going to use this last Princess Snake just for my defense can stay good. And I, I can be tanking attacks. But I'm not really worried about LR Vegito Blue because I already know that he could tank attacks like it's nothing. That's Is that going to be an Ultra Super attack? No, that's going to be a normal attack. That's just fine. Give that to Goku and then give that to Trunks. Okay, yeah, I'm perfect. I was like, did I use... The Princess Snake, but yes, I did. There we go. I knew it. There we go. There goes the super attack. I, I just, I felt the super attack coming. He hasn't done one in so long. I just knew it was coming. Ho I thought my Vegeta Blue was going to have that chance to dodge, but he didn't. So, it's all good. But Vegeta Blue not really going to take that much damage. i say about 88,000. Oh, I was so wrong. I was way off. It's only 3,000. Because I it is Vegito Blue, and I did use the Princess Snake, so... What did I expect? Uh, can it be a critical, please? A critical or an additional... No critical. Additional? Yes! There we go! The additional super attack from LR Vegito Blue. That's what I like to see. Oh, there we go. Can it be a critical? There we go! And it was a critical as well. That's what I love to see from LR Vegito Blue. So the one thing about LR Vegito Blue is if Tech Vegito Blue is next, I cannot run... Tech Vegito Blue in and LR Vegito Blue in the same team. So I'm gonna have to kick LR Vegito Blue off the team. So which is like, no, God, I love LR Vegito Blue. I love him. Uh, Goku, can I get a crit? There we go. The crit from Goku. Lovely. Now, Trunks, can I get a crit in additional attack? So far, it's a trick train. I mean, a, tri a, crit, a crit train. We all been getting critical. So now, can Trunks continue that train? Yes, he can. There we go. Everybody got criticals. The crit train is just on a roll. Everybody got those th criticals. <sighs> Vegito Blue didn't get a critical at first, but he redeemed himself with an additional super attack, and it was a critical. But here we go. I'm about to just have, I'm about to just have Vegeta finished off. That's all that's left. I mean, I'm about to have Goku finished off. Sorry. I was just looking at Vegeta, and I just said his name. But I'm going to have Goku finish it off since he's not getting attacked in the front. That's not no. That's not a dull kind of attack, but it's all good because... If Goku can't finish off, then the boy, the boy Vegeta got his back with that Therius Gallic gun. But there we go. It's over. Goku finished it with the 10 times Kamehameha. Honestly, my favorite Kamehameha just because it's red. But there we go, guys. That's today's video. So, yes, I hope either Tech Vegito Blue and Rose are, well, Tech Vegito Blue and STR Rose are next, or Super Saiyan 3 Bardock. So, Either or, I hope one of those two banners are next. Like I said, let me know down in the comment section what banner do you guys want to be next after Angel Go and Frieza. I will all, I'm always down and I just love to hear you guys' opinions and what you guys think. 
But other than that, this is me about to drop, guys. Leave a like and subscribe if you guys enjoyed today's video. And yeah, like I said, this is me about to drop, guys. Hope you guys have a fantastic day, and I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. See ya.